Now, a simple test that you can do uh, before you go going to buy an expensive titanium bike and you want to make sure that it's titanium, or if you want to see if your bike is either aluminium or titanium, uh, then uh, you can do a test with a, with a magnet and uh, get a strong magnet, hang it up from, uh, from, the, from the rafters or something, anything, and uh, get it very close to the frame in question. Make sure you've got no cables or metal objects very close to the, to, to the magnet. And all you need to do is basically move the bike in question over the magnet. If uh, the magnet moves like it does now, so this is aluminium because aluminium reacts with a magnetic field, but titanium doesn't. So you can actually see that it's starting to move and, uh, and uh, it's not the air movement that does that. It's actually the magnetic field because if you, if you get a plastic pipe and do the same, it's not gonna affect the magnet, not in an open airspace like, like it is now. So see, you can actually just uh, make it actually move quite sudden. Um, so basically, <laughs> this is a good test before you fork out a lot of money for something that you believe is titanium, just do that test and, um, and, uh, and it always works. Titanium does not react with the magnetic field. Okay, cheers. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.